This review provides an informed opinion for anyone looking to alter their dedicated home cinema screen from white or gray to black. Note. The following results, captured via a handheld iPhone, are a second generation. The results are more evident to the naked eye, the first generation. The black screen absorbs light and color, which the iPhone captures well. However, the white screen captures higher contrast and white levels, captured as a glow on the camera. It is not present to the naked eye. The black yields a texture that reduces detail. The white has no texture, and the detail is increased. White levels decreased, with low mid-tones. Pure white representation, high mid-tones. Black levels absorbed, low contrast. Black levels are normal, producing high contrast that's more natural. Low color gamut, less color spectrum. High color gamut, higher color spectrum. Note, more natural color and detail are present on the white screen. Higher contrast, color, and clarity showed. Look at the horse fountain statue, lower left in the images, the stars in the sky and the light from the Eiffel Tower. The results are black and white. White screens in a dedicated home theater present the best visual image compared to black screens and black screen paint products.